that and on this week's episode of Boozing Bands we're playing the dating game. It's a sort of way to see how well the band knows each other even when they're not actually being themselves. So what we've done is we've made one person the dater and two people the dates, and we've assigned them sort of personas of sorts where whether it be a famous person or just a sort of person that you come across in day-to-day -day life and we have to see based off of questions if the dater can figure out who the dates are being and if the dates can figure out what the dater is. Hey guys, welcome to my show, Dating Game. Um, I got two bachelors here and it's gonna be awesome. So, um, why don't you two like start by telling me a little bit about yourselves? Well, Becky with the good hair. Um, I am like really into. Uh, I'm really. Into, I'm like. I'm. I'm a, uh, I like to think of myself as an artist. Yeah. So I, um, you know, I play cello. Yeah. And. My favorite thing to do, you know, I really just like, I really like to inspire people. I really like to inspire people. Yeah. But I'm also broke. So I think that yeah. it's good for people to give me money. Yikes. Um, cello, you mentioned you play cello. Is that like, um, guitar? No, it's like a cello. Like, um, like upright? Like, how do you not know what a cello is? Okay, how about you? Hey. I hate this. So, uh, tell me a little about yourself. Like, what's your favorite coffee order and stuff? Mine's caramel macchiato. You? Double shot. I love uh, espresso. Uh, whiskey. Whiskey? Whiskey. It's my favorite coffee order. Huh. Unorthodox. Uh, I like it. I'll just try that after yoga. Sometimes I really like it. Nice. So, time for the first question. If you were to cook me dinner, what would you make? You know, I'm so glad you asked me that. I really like to make things, um, you know, as economical as possible. Yeah. So, my favorite thing to do is usually I'll find, like, a few people's, you know, like, metro cards that they've almost thrown out. And then, like, I'll go on the subway and usually ask a few people, like, oh, you know, like, hey, do you have any food? And then people will just, like, give, they just, like, give me stuff. So, like, I'll probably cook you, like, you know, half a sandwich from Pret that someone was gonna throw away, yeah. and then maybe like a banana peel. But can I get that banana peel um, whipped, no chai, and um, with a double shot of um, strawberry creamer, and actually um, no sugar, but also powdered milk instead of condensed milk? Mm. Well, sometimes people do throw away Starbucks orders, so maybe. <laughs> nice. Cool. How about you? If you had to cook me dinner, what'd you make? Well, high maintenance, Upper West Side, New York girlfriend. Close spot. <laughs> <laughs> You're missing the heart of me. My passion, after yoga. And Justin Bieber. chicken because you can't always get what you want. So I'm confused because I thought you cool. got an accent a second ago. <laughs> yeah, you got an accent. Okay, so more questions. So, bachelor number one. We're stranded on a desert island and you can only bring three things. Okay. What do you bring? Well, obviously I'm going to bring my cello because, <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm good at. Yeah. Um, I probably bring my cello case nice. because, like, I need that to, you know, collect stuff. Yeah. Um, and then lastly, I probably bring my... My hat. Because, you know, you need to, like, pass around the hat every now and then. That's all. Cool. I think. Um, bachelor number two, same question. Oh. It's a ledge. <laughs> I can't even start my day with all of these, seriously. My favorite pair of tight jeans. Cool. Uh, my harmonica. Nice. And, uh, my, uh, m uh my friend Keith. Kid, um... What's Keith do? Sounds hot. Uh, he, a lot of drugs. <laughs> awesome. I don't really like, I'm not really like into drugs, but I don't know. I kind of have like one drug. <laughs> Crazy. Um, Cops. I got another question for the audience. Okay, bachelor number one. What's your perfect date spot? 
so crazy. So like, I can't believe you just asked me that. So usually yeah. my favorite date spot is there's this great, this great platform between the, where the L transfers to the one. Yeah. Oh my God, it's beautiful. So we go there, we sit out like a nice <clears throat> piece of cardboard and we sit and I would probably like, you know, like have my cello case out and then like we would just like, you know, you would just watch me play. Hmm. Sounds a little <clears throat> one-sided. Bachelor number two, same question. Rock concert. Madison Square Garden. Cool. So cool. Um, so do you have any ideas of who your bachelors might be? I think I have like, a little bit of an idea. I think bachelor number one's <laughs> homeless street performer. <laughs> Close enough. Yeah. <laughs> he plays the channel. Subway, Subway Buster. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> They're not all homeless. <laughs> you made him homeless. I made him homeless. They're not always homeless. <laughs> Wasn't at all in the description. Yeah. I know. I made a decision. You made a choice. Right. Yeah. And um, you're Miss Jagger. Mm -hmm. Who is your bachelorette? Are you like the really annoying girl at Starbucks who like? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, in Starbucks. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. It's actually Gemma. Gemma. Yeah. Yeah. Gemma. 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 Gemma.